What's up, Metal Brethren? This is Scott Tannic one coming at you again live from the dungeon with my first discography review. Now, this is going to be a series of four videos. I'm going to give each four albums from this band a bit of attention. Um, this being my first discography review, I decided to go ahead and do a band that doesn't have a lot of records out yet, just to kind of wet my beak a little bit here on doing a discography review. Um, that being said, I'm going to talk a little bit about the band here first. They are a black and thrash metal band from Ohio, and they are Skeleton Witch. And they had an EP before their first album, which has a lot of the stuff on it. The first album has a lot of the stuff from the EP on it, so I'm not really going to get into it, being the fact it's really hard for me to get a, get my hands on a copy of the EP called That One with the Shadows. So we're going to go ahead and just get into their first album, and that is this one. Skeleton Witch, Beyond the Permafrost. Really great debut album, guys. Um, I can't praise it enough. Go ahead and get in some really good tracks on here. Upon Wings of Black, the title track, Sacrifice to the Slaughter God, Baptized in Flames, Vengeance is Mine. Well, Vengeance will be mine. Sorry, Vengeance is Mine is Warwood Angel. Anyway, um, Limb from Limb... Remains of the Defeated, Soul Crushing Black Sorcery. This is an amazing, amazing record. Now, the thing you got to know about Skeleton, which is they kind of tune in a standard E tuning, and they just riff, the riffs on all Skeleton Witch's albums are just insane. Um, their singer, Chance Garnett, his vocals are just kind of signature, really kind of screechy sounding vocals. I mean, some may not be some people's cup, cup of tea, but. Me personally, I fucking love it. I think, you know, this is probably one of the better bands of the later 2000s. Goat Horror being the other one. Um, really big into this band. Um, can't really praise them enough. I've never really got to see them live. So I don't know about their live show, but as far as on record, on their albums, they are fucking stellar. i um, going to go ahead and rate Beyond the Permafrost, a stellar debut album. I'm going to go ahead and give this one 4.5 out of 5, being the fact that it's just great. It's really fresh. It's kind of not a tired sound, in my opinion. Um, the only thing that stops it from getting a perfect score is I think, you know, this band had a little bit better, more to offer, you know what I mean? They hadn't really come into their own yet, but yet, stellar, stellar, stellar album. Um, I can't really praise it enough. 4.5 out of 5, so, you know, that being said, go ahead and let me know what you think down there in the comments, you know, like, subscribe, tell me you think Skeleton Witch sucks, you know, if you do, then, you know, that's your prerogative, I think they're a great band, gonna come at you here again soon with part 2, the second in their 4 album discography, stay tuned.